everybody welcome back to another episode of trophy seekers outdoors we're back on the tennessee river i'm free lining i'm by myself this morning just got a couple out here in the rod holders chicken on a weightless line fishing with 12 pound test line and uh gonna see if i can do this by myself i've got uh, running two rods got one on already got one on? Oh, yes Fish on, guys. Fish on already. Uh, he got off. Got off. Oh, well. Throw it back out and try it again. Oh, like I say, we're just free lining. I'm by myself. and Let's see what we can do. I already missed one. It was probably just a small channel. I'm up at just below the dam starting out here and I'm going to be drifting probably a couple of miles down the river. Uh, I'll be probably picking up and moving and going places but like I say just 12 pound test line on a medium action rods, spinning reels, just like what you'd bass fish with. The uh, only difference is I've got a swivel uh, with about a two foot leader on it. And, uh, let's see what we can do. We got a bite on the back rod. I didn't get far enough to get on the I know it ain't on the bottom. Cool, 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 cool. Fish on, guys, fish on. I don't know how big he is, but it's the fish. First fish of the morning. He doesn't sound feel very big at all. He doesn't feel very big at all. Small blue. I believe I can put a boat clip in. Small blue. Two pounder. Too bad, not too bad. Not for drift fishing anyway. bad of a fish guys about a five pound channel cat drifting free lining with no weight it's letting go try it
probably a 10 pound here. That 8 10 pounds. Blue. Right here at the fence three. Alright. This one, cause my buddy Rose is having a fish fry at his deer hunt, uh, his deer hunting land. So I'm gonna put this one in the, in the live way. Fish guys, good fish. Good fish. Whew. That's a decent fish right there. Hopefully he won't get more than line. Coming this way. Going this way. Uh-oh, I think he's in my other line. Middle of the river. I'm going to try to bring him back and keep him out of them run. That's the thing. No, this is going to be a mess. I don't. This is a nice fish, guys. About ready to give this spot up. Finally hit it. pounder but I'm sure appreciate it oh there you go again oh oh nice fish there you go good fish guys good fish. I don't know probably 20 a lot of current out here. Makes them feel a lot bigger, but that's a good fish anyway. Can't complain about that. Uh, find my net laying right here at my feet, so I'll be all right there. He's uh, wrapped all in that line now. That's all right. <laughs> Alright. Man, that's a nice fish right there, guys. That is a nice fish. Whew. Got him. 
I didn't know if I had him or he had me for a minute there. I think he's got three lines. I guess that means I still got one line out. <laughs> oh. Nice, nice, heavy fish. <laughs> Holy smokes. He's got some weight to it. He put some weight on. Does I have a mess here? What a mess. Alright guys, I'm going to get the scales out. Let's see if we can weigh this. That's a nice fish. I'm going to put him back in the net. We're going to weigh the net first. Well, there we go. Let's weigh this net, handling everything. Three and a half pounds, 3.6. So let's put him in the net. Lift him up and hang on the chair. Thirty two, right on thirty two. So, 28 and a half pounds, guys. Whew, I knew he was pretty good size. 28 and a half pounds. Oh, and he's made a mess here. Let's see if we can get him up and show him a little better. And then get him back out in the water. Ugh. All right, guys. 28 and a half pounds. That's a nice fish. Let's let him go. Let him let somebody else catch you another day. Awesome. Yes. Now we got a mess. Clean. 